are here in Indianapolis, the 2012 NFL Combine. Uh, we got to make sure we get the guys all the way through this process. So one of the things we do is have a suite to support the guys. Uh, so we're here at the Omni Hotel, and you can see behind us uh, the players' hotel uh, right down across the street, so we're a short distance. That's closed off. We're not allowed in. Over here, they have a part of the building where they're doing their interviews. They have meetings. Um, so they're in that building. In the background, you can see Lucas Oil over there, so again, really close. But we have the players come over here to the suite where we're now supporting them with a lot of different things we need. Uh, a lot of different recovery means. Uh, our soft tissue therapists, our therapists, uh, making sure we keep the process going because we've been training them for weeks, but we did it with a plan so that they'd be peaking. We are trying to peak them for their best performance at the combine. We weren't looking for their PRs two weeks ago. I'm looking for their PRs in three and four days. Now the way the combine works is it is a four day process. Uh, and actually for our West Coast guys, five days. They have a day zero they fly out here on. That was yesterday for our first group. Uh, got in the pool, did their basics. But it's a four day process where each of the days they're doing different things. And only on day four, that last day that people see on TV, do they actually do the running, the field drills that people see. So every day there's a little bit different stuff. Um, really important that we make sure through the process they're keeping mobile, they're getting blood flow, they're rehearsing mentally and physically, and we keep things active. The best peak doesn't happen when they've sat on their butt for five days after they just spent weeks and months of training. So we're still making sure that peaking process happens and we get the best possible performance.